pretty soon. But my kids love, love Scentsy Buddies. And what does your Lexi smell like? Do you, can you still smell it? Mm -hmm. Yeah? See, it's on the back. It, I think, is sweet pea and vanilla. Yeah, let me smell. Ah, oh, smells so good. Hmm, that smells really good too. Sweet pea penguin. and vanilla. Penguin. You want to get yeah. your picture with it? With the penguin? We always, every time we come to downtown Seattle, we always act like tourists. So this is where we always park. Oh, this is where we walk around the cheese. mall. Girl, say cheese. One, two, three, cheese. Then go get cheese. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's so fun. But um, I like this mall because it has. Um, I see my car. Okay. Oh, you want to see a picture? Yo, no, Dad took the picture, not me. They have Lululemon. They have Tiffany and Company. Um, <laughs> then they have other eh, stuff, but those were all the stuff that I used to love. Not anymore. Now I'm a homebody. No more of a fashionista. Did you hear me, babe? Is this where you got my ring? Yep. Oh, this is where hubby got our wedding ring. I said that, um, they used to, um, we used to walk around Lululemon and other stores, but now no more. <laughs> I'm no longer a fashionista. I'm a homebody. Friends, as soon as you go outside of the mall area where we, we park, we're going to go down to um, Pacific. Oh, we're going to go down to Pike's Place. But then this is where city life begins. This is where all the music are on the streets. People walking, chatting. My dad wants it. Like when we go to buildings. We need to come here more often like during the summer and fall, not on the rainy season. <laughs> we usually tend to come here like rainy season, so it's always cold for us. You always have street performers. It makes it fun. It's like a party out here. I'm going to be a tourist so I can show all my friends. Right here. It's really nice. I never really, um, never seen that before. I never realized that that's the building for allrecipes.com. We also go to which? What other mall do we go to? Uh, Westlake Center. Right Westlake here. Center. I thought it was here. All right. Now this is Pine. Pine Street going down to Pikes. Pikes Place building. That's where they park the car. More buildings popping up. The what? So she's asking there's so there's certain buses that's on cable? Yeah, so it's instead of it being fully gas, it's kind of like parking yeah. gas. So it's on the bus. It's power. dual, right? Yeah. Part of the part and gas. Got this tall building. Come to the left, Danny. To the left. All right, Danny. All right. All right. We're gonna go straight ahead. So when we play Taurus in downtown Seattle, we go to the monorail and then go to the what do you call that center with the music? Seattle Center. Seattle Center. We go to Pike's Place. We go down to the dungeon of the Pike's Place, which is at the bottom. We go get our um, hambao, right? Mm -hmm. We, hambao yeah. We go to the original Starbucks. Original Starbucks. Those are all our spots when we do like to be tourists. And oh, Ivers at the waterfront or the waterfront restaurants, right? Yeah. yeah. What else is there for people, for our friends that wants to come and visit? What else is there to do? downtown or just in this area? Uh, around this area, so public, the Pike there, Public that, Market. That macaroni and cheese place? Oh yeah, um, what is that place? 
are we on? Beachers. 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 Go to Beachers. It's always a long line, so expect that. And then there's a um, along along that strip by Beachers and the original Starbucks. There's a lot of um, eatery place for international taste. Really nice. So Rabbi's like, we also go to the gum wall, which they actually cleaned, I think, last year. And now it's just back to its original uh, grossness again. I don't know what everybody loves about the gum wall, but the gum wall is basically an alley down there by public public market where they stick their gum, uh -huh, use gum. And you walk by there, you have to put your gum on the wall. Yeah, that's a rule. Mm. Here we go. Every time we come down here, we always tend to catch the market close because they close really early. Five. Oh, you know what? They have their new market now. Yeah. Yeah, they updated the market. So let's go see what it looks like. Beachers. This is how they make their cheese. You want to go in for lunch? It's not that long of a line as always. Did you want to go inside of Starbucks first? No, I don't need anything at Starbucks. It's up to you. Yeah, we can. Going in here because usually it's a long, long line. Oh, go ahead. Go ahead, babe. Thank you. But let me whew, let me show you guys if I can see. Eighteen fourteen for a large regular Mac, sixteen ounces, ten ninety nine, and then have you got the spicy eight ounce? Eighteen. So, beachers, um, this beachers is very popular with tourists, plus they taste really good. Ooh, is this a large regular? Okay. We're just having a quick lunch, but look, making cheese. That's like a the little paddle, gigantic paddle, like how I have with my, um, what do you call that? My little kitchen aid. Danica, you want some? I try. Mm. So, this is the one that we got. Hubby's is really good. Spicy. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Little girls are having fun. Jonathan and Danielle will be back in a few days. So they spent some time in Vegas. Whoa. And then um, Southern um, California to visit with families. But they'll be back in four days. That's how they do cheese. Wow. inside there. So then for our dim sum, or for our hambao, we like to go to the misam pastry for our hambao. Mm -hmm. Talking about it, like we want to go get um, hambao, just one or two, and then um, there's also the donut holes. One time, because the big kids wanted it as well, we waited 45 minutes, but they're really good. So these are good areas right here to go to. Lots of organic, lots of veggies and fruits and flowers. Now this is the famous 
Um, is this the, yep, where they throw the fish? And then also the pig. There's a statue of a pig here. Everybody loves. And then this is where they catch, throw the fish. I'll follow you. There's the pig. It's actually a piggy bank. Pike's Place Fish Company. Where the one? Where they throw fish. And then they have the best cobbler in one of the restaurants here. Oh, this is. Oh, there's no line. Ja Danny, you want. um. Donuts. This is a good place to get donuts right here. Daily dozen. The line can go way over there. We always get the plane. It's cash only. Yeah. Oh, cash only. We're gonna go get cash really quick. <laughs> I didn't bring my my purse, so hubby hubby never carries cash. But we'll go find cash. Oh no, I've got enough tea. But we can. One of the nice um, tea shop right here is the Market um, Spice. Let's go in there and show them. I get my teas here too. Really good teas. Look. Oh, I like these little mortars. Cute. Containers. Lots of spices. I uh, like the peach one, but I, I don't buy your tea here. No, the one that's really like good here is like the... Um, peach coconut. Oh, peach white peony. White peony. Oh, peach coconut. You might like the white peony. You like um, bedtime teas. Are these bedtime teas? Mm, yeah. For four seventy five, I'm better off with a Tivana. Because they're very spicy. Oh, can you ca get cash back? I don't think so. I'm not sure. We're trying to look for cash for the girls' donuts. Um, the one tea I do get here is chai is good. Cinnamon orange is very popular. The original market tea, it's cinnamon orange. See? This is what you want. This one. Look at all the spices. Spices, spices, spices. Oh, Cajun spice. Black and spice. All right, let's go to the ATM. I have not. See, I haven't been on this walkway. I have not seen a newsstand ever in my whole life, babe. I've never seen a newsstand like this in my whole life, ever. You know, like when every time you watch like a New York movie, they always have newsstands. Never seen one, and I've never walked this way ever in all the years of Seattle. Wow. All right. We, oh, oh. Careful. Because we always go through there, but never this way. Oh, look, they got Pike Place nuts, toffee peanuts, hazelnut latte. Hmm. How to sell, friends. Don't be like us being a tourist today. When you come to downtown Seattle, have cash. <laughs> because um, ATMs are rare to find. But we are still looking. We have our hopes up. We will find one. Are they throwing fish? No. So that's the pig. Down here is where the gum wall is. Oh, Chase, yay! No fee. Did you see that? Mm -hmm. We never wait around for it. I think the last time we saw a fish caught was like 10 years ago. Yeah, the last, one of the last times we were here, I was like yeah, waiting. Yeah, she whole kept waiting and waiting. We're going to be tourists today, so we're going to get our donuts. We got cash. 
and we're gonna go uh, take a look at the new gum wall. I'm gonna show you guys. She has a little thing in there that says "God knows when you don't tip." And here's hubby. He just saw it, and then he puts, puts a dollar in there. <laughs> oh, he got scared. <laughs> he got scared. He doesn't want God to see that he does not tip. <laughs> no. I'm just playing with you, hubby. All right. Girls got their donuts. Gum wall. Ooh, nuts. Some people say the gum wall is good. For you friends that have never gone, so there's Pike Place. You go down here into this dirty alley. They cleaned it up recently, but it, it repopulated pretty quickly. See? Just like what he said, they did clean it up, and we saw it on the news. It was like really clean. They cleaned it up within a month. It was back to its original thing, and people were like disgusted because you know they're trying to clean it up, but it's it's a tourist attraction. It's a tradition. So, but let's go show you guys what it's all about. Yeah. So here it is. Here's the alley. Here, everybody's taking pictures. And <laughs> that's all it is. Just nothing but gum. <laughs> gum. Okay, I'll show you guys a close-up. Alright. Close-up. <laughs> yep. Very popular. <laughs> um, yeah. Let's go walk down. <laughs> oh. This is just like within I think a year. What a year or two? I thought they cleaned it up last summer. I'm not sure. But they're getting smart. They're putting business cards. Oh my goodness. Okay. We're gonna take pictures. I don't know what this is, but it's called the alibi room. Yeah, go its way down there. Actually pretty gross. Oh, there's someone chewing gum. It's about to happen. Oops, sorry. They're chewing it. Now you're gonna place it on the wall. Look, there's layered gum. Just outside that gum wall alley. Here's the view. Mm, donuts are so good. Seattle. I think it's called Seattle Bremerton Ferry. Just left. Sailboat. Underneath the market are all these little shops. Hubby loves to go to this one. Are you going to go? Alright. It's a collectible. Oh. Alright, be careful. You see? You see down there? Um, there's also the new Ferris wheel. Well, it's not really new, but it's still new. A couple years old. We still have not yet to do that, Hubby and I. Look at this. Nice little restaurant. Open ceiling. Come here. Come this way. Come on. This way, Danica. Beautiful. Be careful. Hey, don't suck on your thing. There we go. Look at um look at that building right there. Apartment and then they got nice patio covered with plants. We're trying to look for where the new market is. The market like overlooks the waterfront, but this is the market, so like I don't know where it's at. Maybe it's going that way. So we'll go check it out. Beautiful day. We went one flight down and hubby's like let's go through here because there's more shops lots and lots of shops here that you don't even realize all the years we've never gone to this level yeah hubby born and raised here have never gone to this level these are more studios hmm. seattle chef steps oh wow that's pretty cool nice and clean They have studio gallery, um, architect space. They had a photography shop, holy cow, records, CDs and videos. Never knew of this place. 
looking at the see how our yard is so much hill but they just planted plants and flowers but they just gotta weed it all the time because i don't want the grass in the front so we basically went up and down ready we're going back up just to walk off those donuts yeah that's for you baby girl danica wants to do it herself got it Whoa, almost fell. Right, we're inside now. This is where the flowers are. Look what they call it. Stay with Dad. I think they're closing up shop. See, they close up really early. Pretty flowers. Peonies. Hubby's gonna find out where the roastery is at. Danica chasing poor little bird. Oh. We thought it couldn't fly. Okay. Uh, Seattle Roastery. It's about 10 blocks, right? About that. Mile and a half? That's what it said. Mile and a half walking. There he is over here. Good thing we have donuts. Shall we Uber it? <laughs> Uber? No. I do not trust Uber. <laughs> I always tell the girls, do not Uber. Uber is so popular now, you know, but. Still, uh, you don't know who that is. I'm very antisocial. Can't do Uber. I'd rather walk 10 blocks. Here we go. This is how we cross. <laughs> There's no rhyme or reason where you're going. Look, people are going sideways. This is not the original Starbucks though. The sign is original though. Cheesecake Factory Convention Center. This is where hubby and Jonathan come for their for their packs, which is like a San Diego Comic Con. <laughs> they like to do those things. Us girls don't. But um, they do it like one day, two days out of the year. One for Pax, one for Emerald Con. They only get like one day tickets. Hmm. Good thing we got our walking shoes. Hubby, is that the five freeway? Five. We walk from the waterfront to the five freeway? Yes, it's a good exercise. He gave us donuts just to make us walk 11 blocks. I used to do this all the time in college. Oh yes, yay, college life. That was like 20 years ago. <laughs> all right, friends, oh. That is the five freeway. So here it is, Starbucks Reserve, grocery. Main entrance is over here. It only took us 11 blocks. We're finally here. All right, go ahead. get a picture of the... Yeah. On the way out. On the way out. Here we go. Ooh. Ooh. Here we go. Oh, I got it, Ben. Okay, here we go. Whoa. Ah, oh, interesting. Oh. Wow. Okay, just makes it seem larger because there's mirrors over there. Okay. But this is what the Starbucks grocery looks like. Lots of mugs. A lot of stuff that you don't see at the regular Starbucks store. Nice. A little, a little yeah. spout. Even has a little temperature. Yeah. This is more for the hard. Yeah, but I, yeah, we have one of those for the matcha. Oh, nice products. Yeah. It's so nice to feel AC again. The what? It's so nice to feel AC again. Oh yes, yeah. she said it's feel feels good to feel AC again. A lot more merchandise. Ice cream maker. Oh, look at this one. I like that. My battery's low, but I wanted to show you guys as much as I can. Oh, cool. I like it. I like it. 
like the white one. Um, tables. <gasps> There's their roasting roasting machines. Is that what they're called? I don't even know. Oh, oh come over here, Danny. Oh, espresso. Oh, here we go. Come over here, Danny. Wow, look at that. All made out of copper. Oh, it's two levels. Wow, look at that. Look at that. See, that's where they grind the coffee. Even Danny. Danny thought it was what? So when he was pouring it into the cup, I thought he was pouring vodka into the cup. And I'm like, what do you know about vodka? We have it all around the house. Oh dear lord. Because <laughs> we have the... Yeah, I guess this means I gotta drink it up. Because <laughs> we have in the studio, we have a bar. So there's the vodka bottle and that's been there for like a while. <laughs> Connor gave it to Dad for his birthday. Oh. That's right. And here's Danica. Hi. We're waiting for their, um, so here's the menu of what it looks like. Um, here's, so we're thinking of getting what, the, the flight? Origin flight, the trans plus chocolate pairing. See that? Yeah. That's going to be a lot of coffee. <laughs> Alright, this is what we got. It was on that menu, I think what, $28.50? So you got three different coffees. Three different coffees. So you have Vietnam. That's and then two from Africa. Two from this Africa. Is, yeah, this, is, um, this is Congo, and this is from East Africa. Okay. So this is this is Starbucks's um, monthly special one that mm. they have um, that they're marketing this month. Uh huh. And then they have, of course, different types of truffles. Yeah. I don't know what kind of truffles are, but different kind of so, truffles for, mm. for this month. So. So I take it that they're good with the the tasting. Hmm. And it comes with these little. I want these. <laughs> Yeah. She's starting her young. <laughs> you like your coffee? <laughs> She's got water in it. <laughs> and then Danny ordered like vanilla cream, which is milk and water, and then she got some of that too. How you like it? Cheers, baby girl. Cheers. Okay, we just got off the monorail. We are now. Space Needle! So we're not gonna go into the Space Needle. We haven't done that in years. But we are gonna take the kids down uh, to the playground and play for a bit before we head down. Down. Before we, we're gonna take the kids out and play into the playground for a bit before we head up north. Yeah. Have a seat. Look at that. 